morning and welcome back to the vlog. So my finals for sonography school are almost here. So today I'm going to the lab and getting some practice with my ultrasound skills. So I have my coffee here because as you probably know if you watch my videos, I can't eat on days I'm being scanned. But today I'm actually going to be doing an ultrasound on one of my coworkers. She's currently getting a bachelor's in like health sciences or something like general healthcare type bachelors, but what she really wants to do is do ultrasound, so she'll probably come do that after. So she sounded like she was really excited um, to come, you know, to school and see everything in action, and I'm excited to, you know, get to show her everything. And then after that, one of my classmates is going to scan me, so that's why I have to be NPO. NPO stands for some Latin phrase that I don't remember, but what it means is nothing by mouth. So if I say NPO, that's what I'm talking about. Like, you can't eat. Because um, if you do eat, then it kind of makes things harder to see. It makes like gas bubbles and like food pockets and stuff and it blocks the image. And it makes your gallbladder look not how it's supposed to look for the pictures. Um, yeah, you just, you're not supposed to eat. A lot harder to get good images if you've eaten. I can't believe how soon finals are. Our semesters are really weird because the semesters start in March, July, and October. So I'm just finishing the semester that started in July, and then I'll have a new semester start later this month. But anyway, I will talk to you after lab. So now I'm looking at my left liver, and then over there's my right liver. You can see the dark uh, gallbladder coming through. Uh, my camera is turning out really bright, so I have to see. That's okay. All right, I'm done with lab. It went really well. Um, I scanned my coworker, like I said, and she was so sweet and so excited to be there. Um, and yeah, she really wants to do ultrasound when she's done with her bachelor's. And then I had a classmate practice scanning on me, and she I couldn't practice on her because she doesn't have a gallbladder, um, which is fine. I mean, like, if I couldn't get scanned for some reason, I'd still want other people to let me scan them, so like, you know. Um, and then after that, I decided to practice on myself for a little bit and just scan myself because my final for this class is in like three days, four days. So um, yeah, I just needed to get all the practice I could. Um, but yeah, now I'm gonna get some lunch. I actually, I was thinking about it and I've lived in Texas for two and a half, almost three years. And I've had Whataburger like once, maybe twice. So I think I'm gonna get Whataburger because it's like not acceptable to be living in Texas and not eat there apparently. So I'm gonna get that for lunch. I haven't even gotten my food yet, just my drink, but I already see why people like this place. The drive through line was really long so I pulled into a like curbside to go place and I went to order online. And someone came out to ask me what my order was like so fast before I even had time to like actually submit an order. <laughs> um, and so they were all like really friendly. It's like kind of like I guess Chick-fil-A is usually pretty good about that too. Like quick service, everyone's like jumping the gun to help you. Um, I don't like Chick-fil-A for other reasons but I know they have good service and I'm feeling that same deal here. So I can see why this is kind of like a Texas staple. Alright, I got an avocado bacon burger. And it's got the uh, Texas toast for the bread, because this is Texas, of course it does. Alright, yeah. I'm into it. I get it. So, the power was out at my apartment, so I came to Target, because of course I did. But I actually do have something I need to do here, because I need to get my flu shot for work by like, I think it's by November 11th? Um, and so at Target you get like a $5 gift card for that. So I'm gonna go do that and just shop a little bit because it's Target, of course. And my flu shot is complete. Also something really cool just happened, a uh, very small world situation. My pharmacist, when she saw my insurance and saw that it was from South Dakota, she got very excited because 
she also grew up in South Dakota. Um, in fact, she grew up in the same city that my brother lives in, and her grandparents lived in a tiny little town like 10 minutes away from my hometown. It's actually the town that I had my first job in. So very, very small world. Um, <laughs> just kind of a funny situation. You don't meet a lot of South Dakotans here in Texas. So I thought that was kind of cool. So now I'm in the makeup section and for some reason I just cannot find Maybelline. Maybe Shirley is born with it. Never mind, I found it. These lipsticks here are my absolute favorite. I use them all the time. Ew, but somebody is nasty. Please do not be that gross person who opens makeup in the store. No one wants that, that's gross. Um, so I'm back home now and the internet is still out, um, but I do have some homework at least that I can do without it. I have an assignment in my workbook here, so I just need to fill out this diagram. Or well, not just this one, there's like probably 10, 15 pages I need to do for this chapter. And I have work in like two hours, so I guess that's how I'll spend it because the text that I got from the internet company said that it won't be back on until um, like three hours from now and I'll be at work then. So this is basically all I can do. And yeah, this is my last workbook assignment of the semester. So that's like, whew, relief. And then I remember all the classes I'm taking next semester and they're probably gonna have workbook assignments too. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot to say anything, but my name change has become official. Um, I got an email that said that the judge signed and it was very anticlimactic, clim anti anticlimactic. I feel like I'm saying that word wrong. Maybe I'm not, I don't know. Um, and I got it and I was just like, I thought I'd be like freaking out crying, like, oh my gosh, this is such a huge deal. It was more just like, okay, I mean, duh, like that's, that's my name, you know? <laughs> So, like, cool, like, obviously that's what it's supposed to be, glad we got that cleared up. Um, I don't know. I might do a video next week about, um, name change stuff. So leave a comment if you want to hear more about that. So I didn't quite get that assignment done. I got maybe two-thirds of the way through, but it is a pretty big assignment, so I'll probably finish it when I get home from work tonight. Right now I'm just eating some watermelon before work. And then I'm about to get dressed for work and go. Um, the internet is still not back on. Hopefully they fix it before I get back. I really need to study for finals and a lot of the stuff that I'm studying is online. So hopefully I can access all that. I guess I can just look at my phone, but it's so much easier on a computer. So I always buy an entire quarter of watermelon and then I never cut it up. I just like eat half of it and then cover it up with the plastic again and put it in the fridge and then pull it back out and eat the other half of it. All right, and I am off to work. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure to leave a comment so that I know to keep making videos like this one, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.